I'm hating, I'm hating brushing these blades on black. If I had to choose the worst thing I hate about waterfowl hunting, I love layout blinds, but I, something about it, dude, over the something years. Something about brushing them. I hate putting it all in every loop. My yeah. hand, I'm too, like, energized in the morning and your hands don't want to work right. Yep. Uh, what's up? Not much. You got about 25 minutes. We're looking good on time. Yeah. Uh, we might have to rake some more trash here, but they're starting to look decent. We'll get this stuff scattered out and see how good it covers up. We got a filled duck hunt. Not many times do we have a filled duck hunt. And uh, we're going to do a big send. Lay down blinds. We're out of the spread today. We don't have the decoys around us. We're going to try to hide on the outside of the decoys, but in the middle of the field, if that makes any sense. Uh, real trashy corn field. A lot of flat spots. Yep. The, the, the stalks are real sporadic and kind of like Mars out here, but we're going to get at it. Watch the sun come up. Tell me where you're from and what your name is. Uh, I'm from Oak City, Oklahoma. Braxton Buchanan. Just happy to be here. What, uh, is this your first time doing a guided hunt? First time. And so you guys hunt a lot of home, yeah? A lot of hunt, yeah. Ducks? Ducks, yeah. Not very many geese. Okay. You guys shoot field ducks ever? No, none no. at all. All water. Well, that's the idea today. We're going to see if we can't make it happen. I'm excited. Are you from the same city, yeah? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> We went to high school together. Oh yeah, we go to high school together. How old are you guys? I didn't ask that. I'm 15. Are you 17 or 16? Yeah, 17. Cooper Garbarino, Elk City, Oklahoma. Uh, oh. And so I guess it's the same for you. Field ducks is new. Very new. Uh, mainly water. Not yes. many geese there. Well, not right now. You shoot honkers or lessers there? Big old honkers. Yep. Well, hopefully we see some lessers and honkers today. Yes, sir. Shoot. Yeah, we're killing all of them. Oh. Check it out. The new SP320. My wife got it for me for Christmas. <laughs> I'm going to play backup, boy. With... They all landed over there. With the new gun. First time ever shooting her. I cannot wait. We don't even have the mojos on when it, what was that, a pack of 10? <laughs> Hi, Freddy. How are you today? Oh, Freddy gets to watch the sun come up again. Out of his old dog blind. Hi, buddy. Oh, you're just happy to be here. We know. You guys ready? Oh, yeah. Pumped. Hot and ready? Hot and ready. Hot and bothered, ready. Yeah, here it comes. Shoot him with the 20. Shoot the crow. Sh sh sit. 20. Nice, nice shot. shot. <laughs> <laughs> here. No. Shoot the thing. Shoot that thing. There. there we go. I didn't. He came out of nowhere. Yeah, buddy. First duck on the ground, heck yeah, dude. You hey, filming? Oh, yeah. Hey, oh, they're all, they're all. Yep, get down, get down, get down. Fred, here, here, here. Here, here. Here, here. here Fred, here. Come on. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Kennel, here, here, here. Here, here, drop, drop. Kennel. Coming at us, guys. <laughs> Shoot him right there, guys. Fred. I did not hit anything. Shoot him right 
We got one down. Come on, Freddy Rico. Here. Oh, Susie Killer. Fred. Susie Slayers, baby. Yeah, I think we got it. No they dropped, they said they dropped three on this side. Fetch it up! Dead bird! You better sit, dude. No breaking. Him and the dog blind. Always wants to get out there. Stay. Good shooting on this side. I did not kill any with the old 20 gauge. At all. Two big whiffs. Two big swings, two big misses. You guys shot pretty good though. <coughs> On the left, guys. <coughs> 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 Stay down, pin tail up top. go guys these ducks <laughs> shoot these over the top right here shoot them oh oh out front he down good shooting I had to drop the camera chase that goose Shoot that single up there, guys. There he goes. Fred! Yeah, I think that's got to be our shot. Yeah, we got to take those shots right there. Well, the old operator operated pretty good there. Getting used to her. Fetch it up! Fetch it up here! Let's go! There we go. Trickle of ducks. Come on. Come on. Come on, ducks. You can do it. Come on. Here, here. Big fat green head. Here, here. Drop. That's a big guy there. That's a beaut. Look at that guy. One of you guys plowed him over. I might have helped a little bit, but. <laughs>
shoot him. Fred, sit. Fred. Whoa, that was all you, son. <laughs> nice shot. My gun oh, the penny. What? Yeah, Missed the penny? Yeah. That single over here did it right. Get crunched. Yep, fetch it up. Good shot over here. Yeah, good shot, Coop. Good shot, Coop. I wasn't going to wait on him to get out of there. Here, here, drop. At least it's straight. Well, that worked. If we could just keep plucking like that, that'd be all right. You need to sit. Shoot him on the right. Spread! Shoot him. Nice. Good shooting boys. They, they sucked nowhere. in Where there. They I don't know. I looked up and they were going. Did they almost lay behind us? Good. Fetch it up here. Fetch it up. Hold. I, I heard them behind us. I, they came from right there and just. <laughs> here, here. Here, here. Come on, buddy. That was perfect. Come on, here, here. Good boy. Drop Fred. Let's go. There we go. That was awesome. I looked up and they were just right there. Good boy, Susie Q's. Drop. Kennel. Good boy, Kennel. There we go. I know I tapped one with the old 20 gauge on that. Did I interrupt you? Nope. No. Are you sure? You're good. Just playing with my new toy. Oh, what a beauty. Huh. Well, the duck hunt went good. Ish. A lot of the ducks didn't fly. How many ducks did we see? I don't know, maybe 300, 400. At most. Yeah. And there was, I mean, Kenyon said it was a 2,000 bird feed the evening before. And so, it has been every single night. Yeah. So it's a night thing. The bad thing about hunting nights, afternoons, whatever you want to call it, they fly right at dark. So you might get, if you're lucky, if it's overcast, with the wind and kind of nasty they might fly a little earlier you might get 20 or 30 minutes of shooting light but if it's sunny it's probably gonna be late you won't even probably fire a shot so that's why we don't want to try it in the evening is it's already an hour and a half drive that'd really suck yeah if you just got you gotta drive home an hour and a half with nothing but as far as the 20 gauge I love it the SP320 gauge is amazing Big shout out to my wife. I was going to throw her on the camera, but her lovely little self is inside cleaning the house while uh, Grandma and Grandpa watch the kids. So we're going to go out back and pick up Pete at his mess. It's oh, not just happen. me. <laughs> I got to blame you. You Your were mess. in on it. You were like, yeah, let's do it. Yeah, I know. I did call you and ask first. It's bad. We gotta go pick up all the decoys out of the pond because they're all snow goose and they're probably gonna be red because of the clay. You're gonna give them a hose down too, yeah, right? We're gonna have to bring them up here and wash them all. Oh, what a mess. Drew's right, I hope. Oh man, I hope my floaters aren't all stained red. Oh, look at this mess. Yep, all pea diddles ripping. Oh. Let's go see the damage. Oh, lost water. Definitely lost some water. Really only the floaters. Yeah, it's the floaters need to be scrubbed. Look how red they are. I think they'll clean up. Look at the line. Oh no. <laughs> Look. That's a bad deal. It is too hot out for waders. First load getting her out of here now we got everything out of the pond got a pile here we got a pile over there my poor floaters I hope that we can get them cleaned up here I think so might take a Brillo pad and some baking soda but we'll get them shined up huh. it's not supposed to be this warm in uh, almost, almost January huh. We're done, she's cleaned up. We're hoping for some more rain. By the way this pond has held, man, we haven't got rain 
in over it hadn't been like two and a half months yeah. like two and a half months that's crazy two and a half months we've got a sprinkle since then one but nothing to accumulate in the pond uh the way it's holding man i'm really excited to get a big rain it's uh like a lot of rain hopefully this spring we get a bunch and it fills up but we are loaded up got the back full of muddy decoys got the back full of more muddy decoys and we got a muddy frederick but i had a lot of fun shooting the 20 gauge as y'all seen on the hunt fred he broke a few times so i had to deal with him had to discipline him after that he did pretty good but um, a lot of you have asked bob why don't you run a uh a shot collar on fred so ever since he got hip dysplasia guys i'll be very honest i'm not um i'm not in the market to uh just be hard on him all the time he needs to he needs to enjoy his hunting um he needs to be as comfortable as he can and uh dad needs to be nicer and that's what my plan this whole last year has been and it's been working great so some of y'all like to complain about fred or he's not the best dog no he's not the best hunting dog i haven't spent i never spent thousands of dollars on professional training a lot of it was myself and and, and a little bit of professional training but not a lot so you know he's my dog i love him i'm gonna hunt him and Anybody that don't like that, whatever, you know, that's, this is what I'm going to do. So uh, to all the negative people out there that like to say negative things um, for absolutely no reason or because you feel you have to, man, that's disappointing. Thanks, dog. That's disappointing. Y'all need to uh, get a better perspective. Not, not the good people here. We got a lot of awesome folks. And, and you, you know who I'm talking about. There's a lot of people that just, they don't have a lot of nice things to say. I can tell you guys that really, you're gonna waste your time going down in my comments and doing this uh, to all the haters, but I, honestly, you're wasting your time. That's why I don't reply to you. So to all the good people out there leaving positive comments, thank you guys. Um, you're the ones that keep me going. You're the ones that keep me doing this. You're the reason why we're here. So thank you all. Subscribe if you have not. Uh, guys got to go check out uncut outdoors uh, i just posted a, another video up there we did a big water hunt up there that's raw uncut very entertaining and i just put another bird cleaning processing video on there because it seems like that's what y'all want to see over there so we use the bird hitch the wing slinger it's awesome i'm gonna get on the old pit bike do some ripping myself have fun out there be safe do not overload the boats in deep water guys it's getting cold all you guys up north are now icing over completely. Let's be safe. If it's too unsafe to hunt, hunting is not worth your life. Be careful out there, guys. Have a good one.